I did. Come up and squeeze your You should feel it all in here. In your hamstrings. All the way up. Take it this right here. home now and y'all my camera died I'm sorry but my body is like beyond tired right now my hair like it kept falling um I did go on Instagram live so if y'all saw my like ponytail kept falling so I just took it down but y'all I am so tired like it is 1 27 in the morning so I went to basically what that was was um midnight madness so there were four different classes there no five different classes and um i did four of them so i did denzel's class called tristane i did danielle's class called Boute. so um that just works your butt but it was great and then i did reggie's class that's called move and i did dp's class and that's called heat so i left in the middle of heat because I was just like oh my face is all messed up um it was like 12 40 and i have to wake up so early um i'm trying to get my hair done in the morning by cue the braider so she has walk-in so i'm trying to get there really early so i can get that out the way but y'all i burn like 2,000 calories like i'm looking at my watch and i burn so much but um the gym like just sometimes has things like that and i can't even sit still but <sighs> Yeah, I'm tired like that was four hours of working out about like no breaks like I went back to back so they had food there they had some chicken and I have the chicken right here they had chicken and macaroni and cheese but you know I can't eat macaroni and cheese so they have this chicken right here so I took a plate with me it smells really good but I'm gonna eat it tomorrow after i work out and yes i'm going back to the gym tomorrow morning um i'm gonna eat that after i work out right now i put some cod in the oven so i'm just gonna eat the cod and my camera's about to die so i will see you guys saturday morning i will vlog i guess so yes i need to get some sleep because my body is beyond tired hey you guys so today is saturday on the next day i did get my hair done so um cue the braider did it so i'm trying to show y'all but I'm trying to get my lighting together in here right now um yeah that's not good but i'm pretty sure y'all see it later but they're called princess braids and um it's just two braids they go to the back and then the hair is like left out. So I thought that was super cute. And I'm glad I got it. Um, so I'm about to go work out. I want to show you guys my workout outfit. So I just thought it was like so cute. Um, let me turn this light on. Maybe you can see better. But this is my workout fit for today. And y'all, I love these shoes. I'm so glad I got them. Wait, am I trying to show you? Okay, there we go. I'm shaking because I'm standing on one foot. But those are the shoes. Um, they're called Air Max Vapor. No, wait. Vapor Max Plus, I think. That's the name of them. But I love them so much. And they're comfortable. So I'll be wearing these today. And I got all white on. And this lime green. So today, I think my workout is going to be pretty simple because like I said yesterday was crazy and we did so much and I'm just so like tired and my body hurts so I'm just gonna like kind of take it easy
um yes so today is sunday and i want to show you guys what i got from kroger grocery store whatever um uh, for my meal prep this week so i finally came to the agreement with myself that i will upload my weekly i'm gonna do this journey this eight week journey weekly um i'm going to upload every monday so every monday there will be a new video in regards to my fitness journey so every week i will post it on monday so it's like monday is the start of the beginning of the week to me at least it is because we go back to work on mondays so i'm gonna do that every monday so when you see a video on monday it will have like what happened from monday to sunday so yeah so and i will do my weigh-ins on monday mornings so uh, when i wake up on monday mornings i will weigh myself and i'll let you guys see it and everything so let's get on to what i got and also before i get and show you guys my food i got um i oh people were asking like where i get the meal plan from so this meal plan is part of the hx um, not HX, the heat challenge, the gym is HX fitness, but, um, the meal plan is part of the heat challenge. So when you're doing the challenge, there's an app specifically for the heat challenge and, um, he puts it on there. So in order to get like the meal plan or the food you're supposed to eat, you have to be doing the challenge and pay for it. Um, the challenge is now closed to people so i think the last day to get it to start the challenge was like the 20th of last week because it started on the 16th so i think the 20th was the last day so yeah it's too late now i know some of you guys did it anyway because i posted the video i think that post my first video i think last monday or last tuesday and you guys were still able to get it i left the link below but um yeah there will be more challenges so that's where I got the meal plan from. So I'm gonna show you guys what I'm eating this week and I'm gonna go ahead and start cooking because it is like four o'clock basically and I have to be at an event at Atlantic Station at 6.30. So that gives me two hours. So I'll just cook for an hour and then I can do my makeup and stuff at five o'clock. So let me okay, show so you. I remember last week I made those egg muffin things. They were really good. So I went and got pans for them i didn't know what size i wanted so i got like the regular cupcake size one and then a bigger one which i'll probably use the bigger one but i need a cupcake pan anyway um so yeah and i got some more egg whites you guys look i got the right thing egg whites haha <laughs> all right so i got my ground turkey so this week i got 93 percent lean and a 98% lean. So I got lean and extra lean, and I'm gonna mix those two together. Um, once it gets closer, like at the four week mark, I'll get like only lean stuff. Um, but yeah, so I got some salmon. I got wild caught salmon, some more cod, which I still have another cod in the freezer, but I got this anyway. And I got some shrimp, and the only reason I got shrimp was because I had a coupon so um, this is gonna be for like weekends and so is the salmon so my plan is on Monday through Thursday eating cod for dinner Friday Saturday and Sunday eating salmon and then I can have some shrimp mixed in whenever more so the weekend um, so I got baby spinach I got my green onions asparagus red peppers onions, sweet potatoes, blueberries, avocado, some more olive oil, eggs. These grapes are for tonight when I go to this event because I'm going to the movies. Um, it's the premiere. Well, I'll get onto that in a second. Um, watermelon and um, this sparkling pomegranate lemonade, which I just wanted to try because sometimes I'm craving something besides water and um yeah those are the nutrition facts on it but i'm gonna try that out and see okay so on the meal plan it says like the only fruits that you are supposed to eat are apples grapefruit 
and blueberries so i love blueberries so i already mixed this in with my oatmeal in the morning and i don't really like grapefruit and apples are like boring to me so i don't eat them so i'm fitting watermelon into my diet whether it's on there or not i have to have watermelon so i eat my watermelon at like lunch or a little bit after lunch like as a snack so i did it last week and i was fine um these grapes i got i'm not supposed to eat grapes and i only got grapes because i'm going to the movie premiere event tonight um the movie hasn't came out yet what is the name of it oh breaking in the gabrielle union movie so i got invited to see the premiere of that um so they're having us they have food for us there but I'm going to put some of these in my purse because I'm not trying to eat extra bad because I know it's probably going to be like popcorn and sodas and all that. So I need something healthy. So I got some grapes to take some movies with me. And then these pomegranate lemonade drinks. I just want to try it. I'm going to put that in my purse too to take some movies. And y'all, I always take food to the movies. I never like really eat at the concession stand. I always like bring meals in. Like I bought sushi before, a sandwich, like chicken wings like i bring everything in the movies okay so yeah so what i'm gonna do now is put my ground turkey on the stove and i'm going to start cooking that and mixing my vegetables and the asparagus and i'm gonna start making these cupcakes <gasps> yeah Okay, so while my ground turkey is cooking, I'm going to make, well, mix my egg stuff together and get started on that. So I have onions and red peppers and spinach, so I'm going to put the onions in. And I don't have a recipe that I follow to make this. I just eye it and do whatever. Um, so, yeah. So, I'm going to pour, these are the egg whites, the straight only egg whites. I'm going to pour a little bit the other one in it so I think the other one has the yolk in it I think it will help make it a little more thicker uh, I'm just gonna put the rest of my spinach in here and it looks a little crazy so yeah let me get the other one just to mix some of that in so I'm mixing this one in if y'all saw my video last week y'all knew that I got this one on accident so I'm just gonna mix a little bit. See how that's like thicker? Cause it has the yolk in it. So a little yolk don't hurt nobody. Okay. So I'm gonna take my spoon and mix it up. I need to wash this pan out so I can put them in there. I'm just gonna mix it up. I sh oh man, I should have cut the spinach. That's what I meant to do. I meant to like cut the spinach so it would be smaller, but it's we're just going to see how this goes. And I'm going to season it with some fines real quick. Okay, so it made just enough for five of them. Which is perfect. So Monday through Friday. So I'm about to put these in the oven. And I just seasoned it with garlic. Um, some Mrs. Dash basil, tomato, and salt. I mean not salt, pepper. And yeah, so I'm about to put these in the oven I put them on 350 I let them cook for like 30, oops, like 30 minutes so turn the light on so yeah so I'm gonna let them cook in there and up here my ground turkey is basically done so I'm about to take this out and put this in a container and then cook the vegetables that I mix in with it okay so I put the vegetables in here and then over here, I have the ground turkey, and this is heating up. I'm about to put the asparagus on that. Okay, so to make my asparagus, um, first I just put it in here, I washed it off, and I just take some olive oil, and I pour it in there, and then I'm taking my Mrs. Dash tomato basil garlic, which I said I really don't like these because 
they don't taste like anything so I can put a good amount on um, put that on there and then my garlic I got from the farmers market can I open it with one hand there we go and like I'm probably gonna use the rest of this yeah lots of garlic I love garlic and then I am going to put some pepper on it And then I'm going to close it and shake it up. So it gets all nice and mixed up. Shake it, shake it, shake it, shake it. All right, so I'm gonna come over here and spray this. Pull this out some so nothing catches on fire here. I'm just gonna take the garlic and spread it out. I mean not the garlic, the asparagus. <sighs> Yum. Just make sure it's like even on here. Alright, so I'm going to let that cook. This is cooking. Let's check on this. It's only been like 10 minutes, so you're starting to get fluffier. And while I'm waiting for that, I'm going to cut so, my wood. Uh, they are ready. Um, I poked a hole in this one to see if it was like, focus, to see if it was good and finally finished. And I made these so big, like look how big they are they were huge when they were cooking so i'm gonna let those cool i cut my watermelon up this is my lunch for the week ground turkey with the asparagus it's delicious and i'm about to put this cod in the oven um i'm just gonna go ahead and make three i know i said i like making them every night but i've been getting home late from the gym so I'm just gonna make those three for now. And yeah. 